don't know how we'd like. Hi, like, welcome to honor Big's that. Big Adventure. Uh, this looks like a Unity knockoff game. Nope, Unreal Engine 4. Oh, so this is modern. Oh. Open world, big, exciting adventure. Oh. Is this a... Is this official? No, this is insane. Okay, okay, okay. In that case, I, I'm a lot more... I could be a bit more... Uh, they would never make a big game. Yeah. Ooh, an upgrade. This is a, uh, this is a fan game Correct. with what looks to be no objectives. No, there's an objective. It's Catch Big. He's just in a random pool of water you have to find. Oh, so Big isn't the cat, it's a fish? So Big's the cat. You're finding, you're finding Froggy. Oh, oh, okay, There's okay. There's a dedicated Froggy button, too. You said you need to find, you need to find Big. He's well, big has to find himself. That's correct. Yeah, that's why I was like, what? It's a story about family. For Discovery. a fan game, this actually does look pretty good. It's Unreal Engine 4. I mean, it looks good. Yeah. It's a fan game. I think Ty even played this recently. I played it on stream uh, for Sage for a bit. I'll, I'll admit this is a good game. When the shit post is too strong and it becomes a real game. Good is subjective. I've learned that recently. So I don't know if there's a way to find Froggy, but uh, yeah, we're just gonna play this till like, uh, the stream's over. So, I mean, I go until at least 2 a.m. my time. There's like a weird mix of like level design and just throwing shit at the wall that then see what sticks. For this like open world. You thought this was a shit post? Nope. This is a real game. And there's like real speed tech and everything. There's speed tech in this game. There's what? Only speed tech. Cool. Thought there wasn't speed tech. <laughs> I don't know. Some of them recent Sonic games have been mad as slow. Uh, the slow Sonic Labyrinth earlier. Yeah, right. The real fan game, yes, but I wouldn't call it a you know regular game. I'm a real game, a real game. I think this might be a beta too because it's pretty empty. The world minus wherever you have to do. Oh yeah, absolutely. Go fishing. Like, like a hard press call is an alpha. He's somewhere in the water. Could be right here. You know how you could get away with making a uh, making a big game, make it very similar to that one uh, game where you're the little girl with like a fishing rod and you like got a grapple plate. Mihara Kawase. Yeah. Oh my god. I can see that totally working. With First it. game. That game is uh, super cursed. I played it before and it was all right. It's just. It's very oh. hard. Have you beaten it? No, I didn't even get past stage one, but I played it. Exactly. That's that's my favorite thing to ask people who if they like a game that's like, I played this. I'm like, oh, you did. I guess what do you think? It's like it's pretty good. It's like you play one level and you play the rest of it. It's like oh, I played the one level. And it's like oh. Yeah, it's the moment I touched it, I recognized ah, oh, I can see how this is a fun game. I don't have the skill set for this. Oh no. I got my friend Knight to play that. And he's he's almost beaten it. That game has like two sequels of the GBA, doesn't it? No, it has a lot of sequels. No, it's a full series. They, it had a recent game on the Switch. Oh, whoa. Starring uh, Magical Girl Cotton as one of the characters that shows up. I think she's even in a fighting game. Ooh. They added a reset now, which is great. So you could, uh, if you get stuck, you could just reset out. Nice. Wade is based on fish. Can you do anything with fish in this game, or are you just fishing? 
A fish. Oh. Let me like tell it, you, I am tired question? of fishing. I thought you were like, either to get items or like, insight on where your fucking problem By the way, is. the moon is still destroyed. Oh. What do you mean, still? Finally, give interest you, the moon gets blown up. Oh yeah, huh, okay. Whoa. I know Sonic games. I played Adventure 2. Yeah, that's that's it, like a okay. thing that happens. The moon never got repaired. The moon's broken. We gotta fix it? Nah. Nah. Why would you fix the moon? It's like we're the still ultimate... playing Sonic Adventure. Well, the ultimate life form's still up there, man. Why is that continuity? Why not? It is a game that happened in the series of the Sonic Adventure series. Of course it is canon. The Archie comics are canon. They are canon, right? This is your reminder, uh, yes, I think it is, but uh, John St. John, actually Duke Nukem. Who voices big. What? Yeah, look it up. Don't believe me? I'll, I'll believe you, mainly because I don't want to... I don't want to have to like reorganize my desk to where I could actually, you know, do that. This is this is Duke Nukem. Froggy, where are you? Yeah, blow it out your ass, Froggy. No, don't blow it out your ass, Froggy. I love you. He used to. This is still Duke Nukem voice if you hear it. He's now Ryu from the streets. Eggman can blow it out his ass. Guts. Kind of hard to do that voice. It is. It's not, like, difficult to achieve, like, to get there, but, like, trying to perfect the tone is the hard part. We gotta we gotta find uh, Froggy, though. Gotta... It also doesn't help. I wish there was an upgrade that told you where he was. I think that would be cool. I mean, this is a... This is a uh... Game. They may eventually get to it. Yeah, he hated Big so much. Why did he even do the voice? It's a paycheck, baby. Fish uh, flying in the air. It's normal. I mean, it is in some areas. The big fighting. How do you feel about fish? Wow, it's a ridiculously detailed fish. I just looked up. Oh well, it's okay. How do you feel about fishing mini games in uh, in your video game? Uh, as I rant about it a lot, as someone who has had a fishing hook impaled to them because some idiot threw the. Oh yeah, yeah. Back, yeah I... No. Never. You would Get rid of fishing. Fire. You would not like breath of fire. <laughs> Oh, hey, look, there's the Space Colony Arc. Uh, Good attention to detail. Was... It was in the sky. Yeah, I didn't see it when you had it panned up, unfortunately. Are these warp points? What is, what is it? Another checkpoint. <laughs> Why are there checkpoints in this game? You can't die. You can. You die. Oh, really? Hey, you drown. Ah, I guess that. It is a Sonic game. We would, like you wouldn't have a Sonic game without the the infamous audio. This adventure is big. This is a uh, a fan game air razor called the Big's Big Adventure, Big's Big World, whatever you want to call it. Uh, it was in Sonic Amateur Games Expo. We played a little bit of it on Sunday, and I figured we'd play more of it today. Maybe we'll play more of it tomorrow if there's more time. Man, I don't think the developers intended it, but that fucking that fucking uh, canyon with the stretchy textures on just like big Guild Wars vibes right there. Oh god, the music doesn't know what to do. What are you two supposed to know? Does anyone know where any upgrades are or like anything that we should check out? Oh, wait a minute. Is this just Breath of the Wild but with Big? Big of the Wild. Yes. I would be so down for that. Let's do the loop, even though I know it doesn't work. Because Big can't do the loop. <laughs> we tried it last time. 
Why can't Big do the loop? Why would they put the loop in the game if Big can't do it? It just doesn't work, Wang. This is just a part of the, the racing stage. If this was Heroes, he could. There's just one small problem you forgot about, I see. Big's no hero. Big's just fish. He's just there to fish. Like, he pulls out his cigar and he's just like, Me? I'm just here to fish. That sounded like... Hamburger. No, not hamburger. What's the, what's the purple guy from the Mario... From the McDonald's version? Grimace? That's, Grimace. It, yeah, that's Big the Cat. I mean, you're not, you're, you're not wrong. I wish the map helped you. The map, like, whenever you look at it, I'm just like... Where's the map? I mean, that's how maps work in real life. Okay, really tell you where you are. Nope. Maps don't do that in real hey, life. there's the death egg. That was like only half of a thing in Adventure 2. I didn't really... Oh, no, wait. Death egg is another thing. What was the yep. thing in uh, Adventure 2 that popped out of the thing? The space colony arc that I was talking about? Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, he has a lot of different space faces, it turns out. Well, that wasn't... Eggman, that was Grandpa, right? Mm -hmm. I guess it's just a family line to have a, a evil space base. Maybe. Now, oh, grandson. No, that was Grow Up. Gerald yeah. Robotnik or whatever his name was. It feels like an older name for Robotnik that eventually just got co-opted into his grandpa's name. His real name is Ivo. Yeah, but like... Hey, we were just listening to this music. Like, in the game or in another game? In another game. Ah. I don't have stream audio on because I don't want to hear myself talk. There's a certain psychosis that happens when... No, everyone hates the sound of their own voice, I get that. Yeah. Your, your middle name is Big? Targeted ad for the one guy in your audience. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Let's go to the city. Cause you know what they say. Oh. Living in the city, you know you gotta survive. Did they just drop New York in the in this open world? It's so weird. No, that's Station Square. Oh. I don't know, I don't know locations in Sonic. He regrets Dan Zyver from Evil Zone more than Big the Cat. Oh, fuck it. Yo, Evil Zone rules. Fuck, fuck you, John St. John. You follow me on Twitter. I'm gonna call you out on this, man. Dan Zyver is back. cool in that game. I'll get back to you on that. People don't even remember that game exists. Like, it's honestly, he does a great job in it. Even, uh, what's his name? The guy who voices, uh, Colonel Campbell, who's in that? And he also voices Ben Tan's grandpa, apparently. That um, was always a weird one to me, because, like, I he's, remember He's in Evil Zone, and he loves that he's in Evil Zone. I remember seeing Ben Tan once, and I was like, why does this guy sound so familiar? And then when I, when somebody told me, I was like, oh, sh what? Hello? I love my Evil Zone stream. We did every story mode for Evil Zone in one stream, because I got mad that I couldn't beat the game. I only remember seeing you do one guy, I think it was the big broadsword knight. Galley? Yeah, the one that was playing like an anime ass opening. That's all of them. Oh yeah, huh. Evil Zone was just an anime that they wanted to make. Pretty much. We talked about how it the characters are actually fine and it would be a better game if it was not a fighting game and it was basically anything else. If it was like Urgies and it was a dungeon crawler. I was actually considering cause... it being an RPG, is what we kind of came to the conclusion of. Dude, the Urgies model fucking rules. I'm sad no one ever goes. Your guys, God bless the ring. Yeah. You got your fighting game with all new characters and a couple Tekken characters. And Cloud and Sephiroth. What a weird fucking. And you also have a dungeon crawler. Voice acting is such a weird thing. 
Apparently the guy who voiced Eddie in Ed and Eddie got super fucking boned. Yeah, he got screwed. Hard. Like, that's rough. It is, yeah. I hate that. It's also weird to hear Eddie say fuck. He says fuck in the interview and I'm just like, huh. Like he wanted like better pay or something and then they screwed him over. He basically got yeah. kicked out of the industry. This is just like a port of the level. This is cool. Yeah. The, the 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 long and short of it was he asked for a better pay and they just said no or we could blacklist you and his response is well I quit bye yeah no I respect it I would too because when someone responds to your request with a threat that industry sucks ass they're fishing the fountain at speed highway yeah of course why wouldn't there be where else are they gonna go you're gonna tell me that the, the fish at the buffet are also weird. Jupiter, you're, you're going the wrong way on the highway. Jupiter, you're gonna get ran over. There's no cars. There's no anything in this game. Why is there no fishing. fishing? There is fishing. There was fishing. You were already here too, Gated. What, what are you talking about? It's all the people evacuating from uh, Sonic Adventure's ending earlier. Hmm. This is a story that Sega didn't want to tell you folks. Just fishing. You have the whole goal of the game is to find Froggy. He might be in the city. We don't know. He's in a random body of water somewhere. Look, see, here's the hotel. Keep apart. Reels in perfect chaos. Damn, that's impressive. Although, I mean, that is a thing. And yeah, this is very clearly John St. John line, so. I'm going to eat my woman respecting fish. He doesn't have time for hate. Oh my god, Twinkle Park is here. Which, which, which game had Twinkle Park? Adventure. Ah. Uh. Well, he's not here. This is where he normally spawns. Okay, this game actually kind of rules. Like I said, this this crossed the line of it's no longer a shit post game. It's just it's just a game. It's not those finished. Fish it's are, a game. Those fish are so huge, but they also look like melting plastic. Unreal. Yeah. They're free assets. This world is too big. Don't say that. It's not very nice. I, like, the developer should make this, like, a Breath, a breath of the Wild float. It would work so well. I, you need a way to, like, track, uh, Froggy, though, I think would, would be the way to do this, because now you just have to check every body of water. They, they created these levels pretty well, like they added in some new stuff, but like I feel like the new stuff kind of fits in. Oh. Wonderful Life Belt is in this game. Uh, probably is an upgrade somewhere, but again, I don't. unless anyone knows where they are, I don't think we're going to be seeing them. What's the life bill? Saves your life. Oh, it's a, it's a, yeah, jail free card. Gotcha. No, oh, it's for for floating in the water. Oh.
only there was a life reserver, that, that would be a completely different thing. Where'd it go? I'm just waiting for Pumpkin Hill. There's no Pumpkin Hill, he's not in that game. Well, I mean, he kind of is, but not really. I, but like, why wouldn't you add Pumpkin Hill? Or the worst one, Meteor Zone. I gotta That's go. The name of the... Can I get back in there? Because I gotta see what's in uh, the other part. Go, go left. Is there a lifeline? Ugh. I no lifeline. You... No lifeline. We're done with that. Did you beat it or? Did we beat it? I am fucking impressed. I don't fuck around when it comes to lifeline. I beat the game. It wasn't worth it, but we beat it. Yeah, like very few people can say they beat lifeline. Very few people would recommend it. Yeah, right. Yo, casino area, hell yeah. It's not a, it's not a Sonic game, that casino area. Oh, 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 hold on. What is this doing here? What is what doing? I heard the music. <laughs> We're gonna do a full this, lap. This looks like a Sonic R. two level. <laughs> One of the courses in Sonic R, basically. Oh, I know. Also, for some other reason, I'm getting Makes like TF2 so vibe. Free. So I wasn't expecting this, but this is kind of amazing. Like I said, I don't really think it's fair to call this a shit post. I think there's too much work in this. Oh, people put a lot of effort into shit posts these days. You might get a rare fish just flying in the air like that, but all part of the game. Hmm. Power race. All right, you ready for a chow race, big style? Chow just throws him, or big just throws him. Can I enter a fish in this? Come on, get up. Some dreams are only meant to be dreams, Juker. I would have put an upgrade right here. Missed opportunity. Yo, G-Volt, what's up? This makes so much more sense when you see the Sonic Adventure levels like this. This looks like something from 2006. No, this is this is Sonic Adventure. Huh. I assure you everything has pretty much been Sonic Adventure. Okay, yeah, I like I I can't tell if there's any way to like figure out where you need to go or like where the upgrades are. That that's what I that's what I ask is like find find some way to just like give me direction. Make it a big game of Metroidvania. Part of the hotel exists. That part exists. And go to the chow garden though. Oh. 
They had a way to track Froggy, this would be so perfect, right? But it's it's so cool and how like perfect the recreations are of some of these areas. These what? are not just asset dumps. No, these are these are recreations. I'm pretty sure. Here's another Sonic R level. Holy shit! This is free to download. It's on uh, it's on uh, Sonic Amateur Games Expo. If you want to play it. I seriously thought this was just like they dumped the assets from the game and just threw them in. I didn't think they actually straight up one to one replicated stuff. How long have they been working on this game? Probably a long time. Yeah, like, it's not easy making something accurate to these sorts of things. You know, Unreal, too. Your PC is shit, you don't think you'll be able to run this? I mean, it is a pretty big game. I understand the complaint. God. You're terrible. Come on, get up. Doesn't seem like there's anything up there. There are upgrades in the game. Yeah, there's is upgrades. We found some. What are they? I'm guessing the umbrella is one. Umbrella, better umbrella. Betterest umbrella. It's all just umbrella upgrades. Just let folks have a big the cat game. I would buy this if this was a real game and it had like proper, proper uh, like direction. Any kind I of mean, clues. Like you go to an area, you fish a fish, and you find a clue. I think that's a perfect way to do it. Not that it's a way that I would like it, but I think it's definitely the way that I think would make the most sense. Just catch a fish, beat it down to interrogate it. Where the hell is Froggy? Where the fuck is he? I don't know, man. I think I saw a frog over in Casino Zone. Give me my Froggy, you fucker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it's your Froggy. Do you let me go? Build a chance. I got you hook, line, and sinker. He just, he just makes like really bad like fishing jokes all the time. <laughs> Hyrus. Sega. Hyrus for a side hustle, please. Well, hire this guy. Oh yeah, hire this guy. Holy shit. It's like we better for a second in the game. All fish don't have Bostonian access. Can't go in here. I have 20 rings though. So much to do, there's so much to see. I'm trying to find out which way to go. Ah, uh, you know what they should do for an upgrade for this game? Lift up your lift up your fishing rod one. and then beams of light show you where to go. Of course. You have to climb the towers as big and it, it downloads to your phone. <laughs> big phone. <laughs> you talk to a weird, distorted voice and says, Hey there, Big! I hear you're missing your froggy! If you beat up these 12 colossi for me, then I'll give you your frog back! That seems fair. I'm sure there's a fish colossus. I think there actually is one. There is. <laughs> The eye frog, get get the fuck out. <laughs> That's amazing, but also I hate it. <laughs> You're gonna be here for a while. Yeah. The, the amount of bodies of water that he could be in. But like, oh, yeah. and the blue chaos emerald. What? <laughs> Hello? Are we gonna get super big? Press and hold the chaos button for. The chaos button is B on the gamepad. Oh, oh my god! My the god. Up, god! The emeralds actually work. Now you have super speed. 
How did it say to do that? There we go. Oh my god! Holy shit! He's got, he's got the Sonic Dash in the later games! Oh my god, this feels amazing. That looks terrifying! This is just big t posing. He just turned into Wario, basically, with the Wario tackle. Yeah! What was that about t making me take a while to find out where he was? Well, now it's gonna take a while longer, but at high speed. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh! Uh -oh. <laughs> Oh, you're dead. It went you're too so fast! Dead. This is why Sonic never goes this fast! No, no, Sonic goes that fast. Just that big can't handle it. I bet Sonic went to Plaid once in his life and he didn't like it at all. Found himself a top space ball one. Okay, Very someone cute. find me the other emeralds. We need the other emeralds. Maybe the other emeralds tell you where they are. Like, you know, like, where, where Froggy is. I'd imagine there's one in, in each zone. Well, in each major zone, because like, you found that with the city, right? Maybe there are upgrades at least, of course. I wasn't expecting there to be real emeralds, though. That's that's fucking crazy. What, were you expecting beryllium? Maybe. Hmm. Run through it? Run through what? I think we found the greatest emerald out of all of them. I just, I just need to know where the other emeralds are. Someone find me the emeralds. Point me in the direction where the emeralds are and I will go there. Game FAQs. There's not gonna be a game FAQ, FAQ for this, you know that. Chaos Emeralds chat? Come on, give them to me. Well, I think you're dead again. Got a your power. Like, Once you stop, I, like I mean, my pop can't stop. At some point, Obama has to be in this game. Remember, this is a free game. You can download this. It's on the Sonic Amateur Games Expo. We might play more of it tomorrow, depending on what happens here. Well, not tomorrow, but Sunday. I guess that is tomorrow, but whatever. You know what I meant. 24 hours from now, you could play Jupiter by playing this game again. If you download Sonic Battle R, we're probably going to try and play the online for that. I don't know if it'll work. We'll see, but, uh, got online. 48 hours from now, what am I talking about? Big's just holding on to it? Of course he is. Big isn't able to move that fast on his own. The purple one is on Little Planet from Sonic CD. I have no clue where the fuck the Sonic levels are, or the Sonic CD levels are. Maybe there is direction though, like I'm, I'm convinced that maybe the Chaos Emeralds point you in the right direction. I thought you were gonna get like super big, it turns out, nope. You get, you get better. If you find a big chain somewhere, you're in the right spot. What do you, when you say big chain, like metal chain, chain link? How do you know you're going the right way? Uh, that's what I'm saying. You, right now, I don't think there is a way. Any upgrades, you know where they are, too. Uh, seriously, uh, this'll check some more shit out. I wonder, can you do the loop like this? Oh, absolutely. Yes! Yes, you can! That like, fucking they're, they're rules. That looks so weird. Oh. The mean bean machine layer. Okay. 
So we're looking for Mean Bean Machine, and we're looking for... What was the other one? Uh, Sonic CD? Little, little Planet, yeah. Alright, well, if anyone sees them, start adding me in the chat. Just be like, there it is! There it is, go in that direction. This is, this is a collaborative effort for this game. This would absolutely be a good answer to, like, as a Breath of the Wild, like, Sonic answer. Oh, yeah. Um, I can actually look at the map right now. Does anything look like it might be Mean Bean to you? Like, I really should tell you at least where you are. You just gotta triangulate based on the areas you get in your current position. Pyramid over there. So, Pyramid and New York, you are in between them. Little planet looks like it's a <gasps> Pumpkin Hill actually is here! Yo! Yeah! You guys ready for pimping in the alley? Damn rules. I was going towards the pyramid, but then when we saw Pumpkin Hill, we were like, nope. Change of plan. I told you, Juker, like, you can't make a fan game of Sonic without Pumpkin Hill. I think it's there's illegal. an upgrade on top of Pumpkin Hill. Of course there is. It'll probably let you dig. There is! You know me, the fighting you know me, the fightin freak big. Oh god, please, no. Power rod is rod. much now sturdier and can take more tension. Oh, don't worry, my rod can always take the tension. Yeah, whatever, bro. That's, uh, Sonic Adventure 2, I think, is over there? That's Radical <laughs> Highway, I think. Sonic Lost World? Yeah, what? Maybe that's oh. the little planet? That's not the little planet from Sonic CD, is it? I mean, it's a little planetoid. Odds are it is. I'm trying to see where we are right now. Um, that, that Sonic CD? I don't even see where the Pumpkin Hill stuff is on the map. I'm looking. The problem is you don't see a lot of details top down. Is there a pyramid near? Well, I see the pyramid, pyramid. and I see Let's the city. Let's go to pyramid first. You're currently south center. Am I on the far south? I do. I don't even know if that a compass is another thing this game needs. Programming is. Rats. 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 My knuckles. Impression. Rats. If I don't know. That's where Wild Canyon was. It was right down here. Really puts all the Sonic games into perspective for you when you consider this. Some some guy in the chat, one guy is gonna be like, that's, shut the fuck up. That's not how that works. That's not that's not canon. Shut the fuck up, you. Okay. It works. See, look, everything feels connected. It kind of just makes sense. Pyramid also has an emerald at the top. Did, I could just hear the piano from Pumpkin Hill playing in my head. Like I said, pimping in the alley. Here's an emerald. I want to get to the top was first, it? just in case there's anything up here. Was that a lyric in the song? No, there's a there's a remix uh, someone made called Pimping in the Alley. Because, hmm. like, I was stuck at Pumpkin Hill as a kid for hours. And I vaguely remember all the lines. I don't remember Pimping in the Alley. 
Yellow Chaos Emerald. What does this one do? Mighty Jump. Big Jump. Holy shit! The movement in this game. <laughs> okay, sure. Oh my god. You can change in midair! They put the two player stage? They Dude, everything was just here! You Look, I'm telling you, everything was always here in the game, you just didn't know it was all connected. And I'm, I love that this is connected. So, we'll play more of this on Sunday, depending on when we stop, and uh, basically whenever we finish all the Sage games, this is going to be the plan, is to go through more of this. So shank, dude, what the hell? Hey, it's the uh, H earlier. You could switch on the fly really fast, too, that I like. Like, it makes a lot of sense now why the world is the way that it does. Once you find the emeralds, you're like, this changes everything. I was like, this is okay to... Okay. Game fucking rules. Which means I can get out of the water if I fall again. side place from heroes okay we know where that is feel free to remind me when we're close to any of these areas chat i wonder what determines where emeralds are uh they're they're in specific spots yeah i know but like what's the logic of the, are you giving me clues or something? places where emeralds and like endings were because i noticed uh judging from the ones we already found yeah, because you get one in a pyramid, but like, I'm trying to remember where. Get back to the little planet. It's it's over here. We're we're on the way. Uh, let's get the checkpoint over here. Is that ice cap zone. What is that? Even if I find Froggy, um, we'll just mark where he is. Cause like I'm, I, there has to be a way to find him with Chaos Emeralds. You get all seven of them or something. <laughs> I don't know why it's so funny to me. Big gets all the Chaos Emeralds to do what with it? Find his frog. Find his frog. Of course, the noble thing to do. I love my frog. Hyper realistic blood. For the Chow Gardens. I'm going to fish all the hyper realistic blood out of you. Green Hill Metal Harbor. Where in Green Hill? But like, where is Green Hill? I was wondering what this was. I saw this in the distance. It was like, we're going here first. What is this? Chow Garden. Oh, okay. Like, if, if uh, Froggy was right here, it would be the perfect spot, because, like, we would know exactly where it is. Whoa! Okay. That's a little broken. Ooh, boy. That's fun. I always thought it would be cool if you could play these child levels, and now that I am, I'm very satisfied. Sega is very good about hiring on fan help, so they are. I think... They are. It's, it's like, fan games are great because um, they honestly aren't making a profit. If they are, usually that's when you shut them down. But, you know, for what this is, it's great, and it, there's a lot of potential here, and... Ooh, and Sega's like, yo, you want to make some money with this? You can, you can just fucking do this if you want. Well, yo, here's what you have to not do for the game, but you can do everything else. They'll, they'll usually be like, okay, this one thing, 
do whatever. That's that's usually how a company does it. They'll be like, just don't do this, okay? And then Nintendo is just like, no, Fuck no, you. no. Met Metroid 2? Nah, nah, die. Here's our Metroid 2. Play our game. Which might have been in development, but we don't know. I'm gonna say it wasn't. Like, would have been nice to Uh, no, I'm up. I'm above. Unfortunately, this thing is not always on the case about that because I'm still a little, like, okay. upset about uh, Streets of Rage remake back in the day. Streets of Rage remake? Yeah, I remember that. Yeah, they got shut down, like, day three. I think I still have the original zip file of that, but I'm also pretty sure that a new version exists and Sega just doesn't care anymore. I think it's down here. But they still weirdly care about Fantasy Star. I, I think I glitched out the timer. Oh well. Sure, this isn't. Oh, this is yeah, this is CD. How the fuck Ooh. does this work? Is there gravity on the planet? That looks. Oh weird. my god, there is. Okay, that's cool. What? Okay, where's the emerald? Where's the emerald? We gotta find it. Dude, this is so weird. What the fuck? Five. Oh, they're gonna keep memeing about this five, aren't you? What's, what's the lava over there? Oh, it's Marble Zone. I think. On a planet ride? A shrine at the top of the planet, right here? Purple. Five. Five. Walking on walls. This is gonna look weird, isn't it? This fucking rules. Nothing <laughs> is an obstacle anymore. No upgrade so far has been like, okay, that sucks. Oh, Everything has been... Can... Yeah, okay, that's pretty you, neat. You can I... walk upside down, what the fuck? This is fucking incredible. Big is too powerful. Five. I love how simple all of Big's mobility is. Like, fast forward, fast up, walk anywhere. It's so simple indeed. How do I get off this planet? Big jump? Like that. I'm just gonna leave this. I think this is Marble Zone. Five. I don't know. I don't know why I'm trying to make them sound like Ox King there. Take it easy, Gene W. Thank you so much for stopping by. I think Big Big I think Ox King would be a good fit for Big Choice. This this is a serious game that I could see having a lot of fun speedrunning. But you'd have to know where everything is, and then like obviously there needs to be a way to know where Froggy is. That's the wild card. That's what makes the world record interesting. Oh, it's yeah, I didn't even see the face over there. It's pretty neat. It's a roguelike. This is where all these Sonic levels were, though. We were learning so much about the world. You think that you think Sega would make this canon? Yes. We gotta test it. Lava hurts you, okay. Okay, hey, we're in we're in Green Hill Zone. Where am I going? There's an emerald here. This is a Green Hill Zone. Yeah, it's a Green Hill. Uh, oh, oh, yeah. I'm like weirdly behind. Hey, every Mega Man game is canon. It is. Find a soccer. mountain top with two trees. That's gonna be a little hard because it's a little bit dark right now since it's night. There's a day night cycle in this game, why? Why not? Oh wait, different fish. Never mind. To the left? Hold on. We're gonna get a vantage point. This fucking rules. <laughs> Like, you keep calling it this is not a shitpost, but I think, Red I think chaos. big walking upside down is a shitpost in itself. Devastating chaos blast and destroy all who oppose you. <laughs> what? 
What's the button? Chaos Blast. Uh, this is the least interesting one so far, but it's funny. Oh my god, it holds you in the air too. So weird. Oh, what the fuck? That's a weird hold. Ooh, I see an upgrade. Big jump saving the day. If you know Why where the upgrades the... are too, remember, I'm looking for those. Why does the five keep appearing? <laughs> it's the life preserver. There it is. <laughs> is it actually a fucking item? Oh. Wow, it is. This game rules. It looks so weirdly realistic and I don't like it. Death to all who oppose me, Froggy. Oh. Death to all. Death to all who oppose me, Froggy. What is that five? I don't understand. I was drowning and then apparently I glitched it somehow because it's oh, okay. Unreal Engine, you know? Okay, I wasn't sure if it was a glitch or it's not. It's just been sitting there for a while. I ignore it. I have a feeling the raid message is going to be... Well... Five. Five. That's what that looks like from this angle. Okay. In the what now? That part. Oh, that looks weird. Sonic Heroes. Okay, where's the where's the Heroes Emerald? Metal Harbor Harbor will be in San Francisco. That's what I thought I saw earlier. This is what much easier to traverse this place with upgrades. Small palace building. That could be. Is that it? Yes, it is. Cyan. Press and hold the cast my aim and release to the cast emerald, warping you to wherever you land. Wait, what? Warp. Through the. Ha! Uh. Okay, that's neat. Not the most useful thing with some of my other upgrades, but it's pretty cool. It, I feel like in a in a game with that kind of design, the mind you basically make areas that you can walk into that have like a little gap. It's useful. It's more that I have other upgrades. It is not as useful. It's still pretty useful, but like, I don't know. I kind of like all the other stuff I got more, except for Chaos Blast. I have not found enemies to, to make use of Chaos Blast is the thing. I'm glad I found a Chaos Emerald by accident, because like, I don't know. I would have been like, well, oh, okay, we could end once it's like near two, but now I'm like, hold on. The villain of this game should be Sonic and Shadow. They're just trying to get the Chaos Emeralds back because they're afraid Big might get into some mischief. He's, he's too big. He's too powerful. Give those back. You don't know what you're doing with them. One of the upgrades should absolutely be Shadow's gun. That would be great. Like that is a massive fish right here. Holy shit. Oh, I gotta see this. Ooh, what the fuck? It. Oh, that's a robofish. Yeah, it's, it's one of the robofish, fish. but still, it's like, goddamn. It it really feels weird in scale when you look at it like that. Hold on. It? Oh, well, this one doesn't work. I right, try. Honestly, the speed is the best one. Speed followed by uh, walking on the uh, on the walls. Speed really expedited your, like, discovery of things. Exactly, that's why it's like I got the best one. What happens if you use Chaos Blast on fish? Find out. 
Oh my god, is Big going grenade fishing? Nothing. Yeah, remember, Keith. Yeah, remember, Keith. This is highly illegal. That's why it's cool. When did Big the Cat become such a bad influence? He's Duke Nukem. He was always a bad influence. Let's see what's up here. Nothing. You know, now that I'm thinking about it, I've never actually played Duke Nukem. Does you should. Ever Duke Nukem 3D would be a fun stream for you. Does he ever do anything like a good influence? Of what? Or is he, does he do anything that makes him a good influence, or is he just like corny action guy, period? Corny action dumbass. Okay. It's, it's so good how fast you can go. What? Oh! Not what I was expecting to find, but okay. I don't think anyone else was expecting Chemical Plant to be right here, but okay. You can even use the purple one when you're, like, about to touch oh, something. Nice. That rules. You think you know there'll be oil ocean? It's fine with me. What other movement tech can you get here that can make this even more ridiculous? Super big. There's, there's nothing here in Chemical Plants, I take it? I'm looking for like the upgrades because like I, I, everything in chat seems to be that I've seen is we're looking for um oh there's an upgrade I can tell. the oh, green I the green glow works really well we're an open world game Plastic Rainbow Umbrella. Ooh, the strongest umbrella. Your umbrella can now glide further. That's just, a, that's just a tiki umbrella. You put that in your drink, big. Does purple umbrella stop soft locks? Or, I mean, a purple chaos emerald? Maybe. I mean, you can walk on sur any surface, so yeah, absolutely. That's a dev tool. Yeah, I would thing. love to get all the upgrades for this before I beat this. I don't know if that's possible, but... I will laugh at the second upgrade is fine, Froggy. Aren't you happy that people call me the weird game guy because we get to play shit like this? Hold on a minute, I hear that music. Is this? The White Chaos Emerald. Got the Chaos Emerald. Tells you where he is. <laughs> He's in Sonic CD. I can't believe I was right and there is an emerald that just tells you where Froggy is. It had to be. How can you discern where he is, though? The music. Oh, okay. I thought this was the TV show for a moment. I was like, wait a minute. 
We got the froggy radar. That's perfect. You just have to hear the music and you know he's somewhere there. And then the rest you can do on your own. So that's what the speedrun is going to be. Just get the white emerald to get the froggy done. No, it's not easy to get over here, though. That's the thing. I don't know if I'd say this was the mean bean layer, but like... It just feels more like cartoon. Bingus! Look what they've done to my beautiful head! Uh, which direction was Sonic Adventure 2, though? Because that's got the last emerald. I hate that hedgehog. Complete game now. Yeah, no, it really had everything as an upgrade, so I was like, okay, alright, I'm sold. That, 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 Dr. That version of Robotic was fucking terrifying. Yes, he was. Have you seen his dump truck ass in that show? Oh, yeah. He's Hard a Pixar miss. character. That, that show loves his ass. I mean, I'm gonna stop myself right there. You I love his ass? It's okay. I don't judge. I was gonna say, I'd love my ass. I meant Dr. Robotnik's ass. It's at the top of this. Nothing. Okay. I'm happy I got here. Skyscrapers. Okay. Imagine being the guy who's uh, working and you see Big flying through the air. Maybe this is how he gets around in Sonic Adventure 2. Because he's in Sonic Adventure 2. You just never get to play as him. You just see him like randomly in some levels. I feel like the guy who sees Big floating around is just like, Hey boss, can I take the rest of the day off? I need to get some medication. You saw a cat flying through the air. Ma! There's a weird fucking cat outside! You ever see that video? Yeah. Look, uh, look you got a weird stare at everything! Who, who's saying that? Is that Sonic or is that Knuckles? Hmm, probably Sonic. Yeah, probably Sonic. Fucking cat's back! Don't which, worry, which emblem child, is it? I'll protect... Don't worry, Chow. Protect your princess. Fucking go. Let's do the loop. The fact that the loop is an upgrade is so satisfying, though. It's not... It wouldn't have been satisfying to do it with Big once. He wasn't capable of doing it. He wasn't strong enough. But now, you get a character arc. I have ultimate power. Now I'm just imagining that video with Big and it's just like, Meow. What level is this supposed to be? <laughs> that stupid cat with the infant and 5S is back again! Okay, we're, we're at, uh, California. Is it on fire? Did he escape? Let's go. I don't think it's on fire yet, but I can make it on fire with one of my Chaos Emeralds. Ah, so that explains everything. Thanks, Mike. What's up here? Whoop. Purple's a little weird to use. God, do I have the upside down? This is definitely the right place. Yo, Camille, the big is amazing in this game. Check it out.
Uh, he's got the froggy radar. We know where Froggy is. There's we have the last Chaos Emerald yet. Chaos. Fighter big. There, there Fighter is big an icon is. for Super Big. Super Big now. That super Big has game. to exist. I would everything I've said about this game I take back if Super Big is not a thing. I mean there's an icon for it. It has to be there. Absolutely. You could, you could like walk on the walls and the ceiling, and then there's like a, a warp. You you eat it, and then it works. I'm a little I'm a little sad you didn't just walk along the lift like it was fucking nothing. Prison Island? Where? Right there? Oh, that's Metal Harbor. There it is. I guess the bridge for Radical Highway makes sense, being just right here at the city. I just want to explore this area before we go over there. This is this is California, all right. Like I've I've been here. This is fucking California. It sure is, and I hate it. I don't know why California wanted to make such steep like cities. I hate it. I don't know why they wanted to farm in a desert. Yeah, people people do. Do slopes like these actually exist in California? Yes. Yes. I've had to drive up one from Twitch College. California is real fucking steep. It's fucking terrifying to try and drive up one of those. New upgrade. Their power if, you try to go, if you try to go fast up one of those, you're just gonna fucking cave in your the front of your car. Use this to catch bigger fish. Like I said, if anyone knows, once again, I know I've said this a lot, but like, if you know where the upgrades are, tell us. We need to. We have to get them before super, we get big. We have to get super big. Which means froggy. You really think we can catch froggy without all the upgrades? Froggy goes fucking super froggy and runs away. That'd be a wild character arc. It would. Five. I love that. It's just never going away. Five. <laughs> Who have the same brain cell, just like Goku and Vegeta. Here's a weird question about Dragon Ball that just kind of popped into my head after building a Dragon Ball kit recently. Mm -hmm. Is Vegeta still the Prince of All Saiyans, or is he the King of All Saiyans, since there's only like... King, eight. technically, but, you know eight now, so that would mean Trunks is the Prince of All Saiyans right now. King is too old of a title, though. He doesn't want to be. I don't have gray hair. You have gray hair. But he's got the mustache. Nobody likes the mustache, Dad. I love that. From GT. Mustache. You've seen that, right? I don't remember that from GT. He has a stupid mustache, and they make fun of it, and he has to shave it because his daughter hates it or something. Vegeta? His daughter, Bra. Oh. Why am I not surprised? GT, ugh. Yo, GT is fine. You're just mad that it's not what you wanted. It's got great ideas. Let's respect GT for what it is. I like... I like Nega Shenron, but There's a also, lot of really fine ideas in GT. I've, I've but also, about you gotta... You gotta, you gotta recognize that half the pillars of that show are fucking Fisher Price toys. Sure, yeah, no, but I think the ideas are great. It has the it best was cool. uh, the Super Saiyan form. Yeah, Super Four, four was. Pretty that instead of just cool. blonde hair, made as a way to just you know 
cheap out because uh, it was difficult to color her hair, which is actually why that ha exists. How, hmm, who came up with uh, Super 4? Whoever worked on GT, and it was not uh, Toriyama. Yeah, it wasn't Toriyama. Which people will d say that's not Toriyama, it's, it's a bad form because it goes against everything. I'm like, I don't know, dude, it kind of fits, it's got a really good design. Especially the transformation, there it is. V Baby Vegito is pretty cool. Pause time! <laughs> oh, super big is why the rings exist, okay. Zawardo! Doki Wotome! This is so dumb, this is so why, dumb! Why would you want this though? Because there's not a, I guess to freeze the fish. To freeze froggy. We gotta go get rings. Uh, Witcher, that's uh, that's High Wing. Oh, hey guys, it's me, Green Power Star. All right, now where are rings? And upgrades. If, like I said, if there's any upgrades out there, we need to get. Awesome Green Hill. Let's go to Pumpkin Hill first, though. Just because I'm gonna listen to the music right here. Oh, I see how fucking works. This is dumb. They should make a Sonic game like this. I'm not even joking. Like, actually, a, a game where the, the Emeralds on their own do something, I think, would be a big game changer. I think everyone can agree after watching this. They're like, okay, that was fucking cool. That would be neat. There we go. That's it. Uh, what? Okay. Uh, where? This way. We already got the upgrade here. This game would absolutely be a dope-ass Metroidvania. Yeah, I think Sonic, um, given an, uh, enough open world like this, probably could actually work as a Metroidvania. Very nice! Yo, Jimbles, what's up? We are playing uh, one of the fan games that exists in the Sonic Amateur Games Expo. Holy shit, that's a lot of air. So, like, yeah, you have Space Jump, you have Dash Boots, you have X-Ray, you have X-Ray Scope. It's just Metroid. Yeah. This is uh, basically an open world Big the Cat game, and we played it briefly on Sunday, and we're probably going to play more of this on Sunday, maybe. Uh, but essentially, uh, it's, it's part of the Sonic Amateur Games Expo, it's a good game jam that uh, Sega's totally cool with, and they're like, yeah, just uh, make games for us. And, uh, you know, you're you're free to do them as long as you don't uh, make any money off them. Beat the game in 40 minutes and you can see Big in his sexy bikini outfit. I would have totally been okay though with uh, this being the, the location for Froggy. Where did we jump by you? Uh, Sonic CD. Ah, okay. I wouldn't recognize the zone, then. We, we went there with the planet. Oh, okay. Hey, the timer glitched again. I think I may have unleashed something cursed upon chat. What did you- what did you do? Somebody posted the following statement, Sexy Mankini Big. No. <laughs> 40 minutes, chat. You just have to beat the game in that time. Double five? Oh god, you're right. Big knows how to count. Five. 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 I don't know why it broke, but I love it. The desert, like, it has no reason to be here, because, like, it wouldn't, there wouldn't be any water. It don't stop big from looking. That's, like, the weirdest statement coming from a buddy of mine. What's it's that? talking about a video game, but I don't know what. Should I new game hunt for my boyfriend, or should I get my soul-crushed 
for the eighth time, and I'm just like, context? Sounds like Boyfriend Dungeon. Uh, maybe, but I don't think I've ever heard him play this after hearing what happened with Boyfriend Dungeon. I heard people were upset about some of the characters being super scummy in Boyfriend Dungeon, but that was kind of the point, was they were super scummy characters. I heard Boyfriend Dungeon is a lot like Hades, which is a bad thing to say, because now a lot of people in chat are going to want to play it and be like, shit, I can get addicted again. Oh, oh, I see what the context is, River City Girls. It's either River City Girls or Zero Ranger. Which, by the way, I don't know if you ever played it on uh, stream, Joker. Very good game. People should buy it. Which one, River City Girls? No, Zero Ranger. Which one is that? It is a shmup made by someone who really likes the company Treasure. I think I played it. This is Windy Valley that we're we're in. Yeah, it is. Oh, neat. Did you ever activate Super Big? No, we don't have rings. Oh. I thought you were talking about the other thing. We gotta find rings. Where did you get rings from before? They were just kind of there. Zero Ranger is very solid. I've probably seen it at one point. My, my backlog is basically Psychonauts 2, uh, No More Heroes 3, which I'm so mad I couldn't play today because I was waiting all day for it to be shipped, and it got shipped at, like, 8.50, and it said it was going to be Aww. the latest at 9 p.m. Not happy about that. Uh, I mean, I'm so on the fence about that just because, like, I'm also looking at medical views right now. Yeah, and you know what? Metacritic reviews have never mattered for that series, because everyone always says, like, wow, uh, No More Heroes sucks. They, they, they've always reviewed the game poorly. I don't care. Even Chip Cheesem was talking about this, and I, I completely agreed with him, because, like, I had said it myself and was like, oh, absolutely. Everyone hates No More Heroes, because it's, like, janky and broken, but that's like, congrats, you just described the perfect suit game for me. It also definitely feels like Sudo never really play, plays ball with the uh, with the stuff with the reviews. So that's probably why like he gets hardballed all the time. Also, he said fuck the Metacritic reviews in one of his previous games. That was a uh, killer's dead, yeah. No, it was Travis Strikes Back. Ah. He, he was just like fuck Metacritic. I agree. I agree too. Big's house. The metal rod. Ooh! I had a feeling this was here. Rod is much sturdier now and can take more tension. <laughs> Big's uh, rod was always metal. My rod is rock hard, baby. He says in the Duke Nukem voice. Psychonauts 2. Uh, not, not one. Have you played that game, Duker? Oh no, you said this in your backlog, never mind. I, I streamed one and I played it years ago uh, on my own. I love Psychonauts. Okay, because like, I. Like, play I Psychonauts hear... one, it's very good. I have, but like, I haven't heard any. Like, I was. Like. I thought Psychonauts one was okay, but it didn't really. It wasn't like. Something that jive into the Every, game, Everyone like... says two is better that, uh, that has played it so far. Really? Interesting. What, what is this fish island in the distance? Just trying to find rings. Where are my rings? Good question. You also keep all your powers, which is something that I always like. Why are people saying Psychonauts 1 isn't on Steam? It's on Steam, that's where I played it. Yeah, that's, that's, I played it on uh, 
was it PS2 was the version I originally played? No, I played the PC version, I couldn't play that, and I returned it, then got the, P the PS2. Oh yeah, back when PCs were, like... Inferior. Now, now, that's not the case. I remember back in the day buying a Civ 4, realizing that my Windows 95 PC can't play it, and they're just like, too bad, no return, piracy. Night Lonely. It's not mine. Why, why are people talking about bending moves in the chat? Don't do that. What? I don't know, Hello? I looked over and that's what I saw. Boob bending sounds like a really bad Avatar fanfic. There's an, av uh, an Avatar uh, tabletop uh, game you can play now. I saw that. My, my fucking D&D &D group was like going crazy about that. I would play that. Uh... There's also the Wendy's one. Yeah, and if you're eating Wendy's while you play, you get a bonus. How would we... <laughs> what, what? I, I have an idea of how to make a Wendy's tabletop. No, it exists! I'm, I'm serious, it was made by Wendy's. No, 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 no I mean, like, as a storyline, not as a mechanical thing. Because, like, I've had, like, I remember stumbling upon a, uh, a tabletop idea way back in the game called a Night Shift, where it's basically you work at, like, a 7-Eleven and weird shit happens. So I figure you could probably, like, co-op that for a Wendy's. Just, like, work at a Wendy's one day, three grays in a suit walk by asking for some nuggets. Where are all the rings? I just want to go super. This is how this is how they hide the fact that super isn't ready. No, they have rings. What am I talking about? Upgrade. Water bending. How did I miss this earlier? <gasps> Strongest rod. Yeah, you know strong his rod is. So the question is, are all the rod upgrades linear, or can he just go straight here and I get I think they're the all, strong? um... Progressive. <laughs> what, Camille? What? What do you... What? That is lewd, my dude. I don't need to take this from you, okay? You were just talking about boob bending like 30 now, seconds ago. Yeah. Right? Thank you. The boob bender herself. Just imagine that fucking anime about the the butt combat sports, but just hey, for Joe? boob bending. Yeah. Not that I know what that is. I've never seen it. I actually haven't, but... I know a friend of mine has told me about it. That friend, that friend of yours. Mm. I've actually never seen it. I, I, I'm serious. No, no, I just say, like, that friend of yours may have seen some other interesting shows. Uh, it was G, I'm pretty sure. The ass in that show is, is powerful. There's a fucking data. There's a fucking fake Day Night reference in that game that is just ass deployment. Somebody got funded to make that. Is that kind of upsets me. Take easy, Maddie. Keep the sound like. Where are my rings? There's like no rings anywhere. <laughs> They're gonna get super big. It's like I'm a god who became immortal. Like this sucks. We're. It's my power. I have a change ultimate power, but capitalism won't let me go super hard. Oh my god. It actually lets you just fly. Well, I guess it works without the rings. <laughs> I just I tried it, and I was like, alright, whatever. Big has ascended. <laughs> oh, he's so majestic. He's so angry! He's levitating, he's levitating through the power of hatred alone. Well, congratulations, Jupiter. You've, uh, big, big adventure. But we know where Froggy is. I guess we're looking for upgrades real quick.
Like when he flies, he's got the Dragon Ball sound effect. Really? Hang the en on the energy sound effect, yeah. It's it's faint, but you can hear it. My God, he does. You go to the moon. Nope, it's texture. Big the cat to the moon now. Superman. That was actually a very good movie. Yeah, like we were, we were making allegories for that in Breath of Fire 4, and we're just like, damn. It's a really good movie. That's fucking Vin Diesel as the Iron Giant. Really? Yep. I can believe that. It's Vin Diesel. I think a lot of that. I think that movie shaped me a lot because I always remember the, the diving equipment. Oh, I didn't know that was there. Because I remember like. Really, thinking the hipster was really cool in that movie. The guy that owns the junkyard is just hipster as fuck. I oh thought yeah, rad. that guy became a meme for a while. Yeah. He had really good expressions. Yeah. Another upgrade. So easy to find these upgrades now. That movie made me cry for a robot. Well, you should watch Ant Man, and then you can cry over an ant. Man. No, no, no. It is just an ant. And I'm, I'm gonna be real. Like, I didn't really give a shit about most of the Marvel movies, but I saw Ant Man on cable. That movie's really fucking good. You should watch The Suicide Squad. It's a movie that doesn't give a fuck. I know it's a DC movie, but like, I don't like the DC movies. I love that movie. Interesting, because like. Isn't that the one where the Joker has the damage tattoo and everything? No! Like that's Suicide Squad. This is THE Suicide Squad. They don't Wait, even what? really ever reference the other movie because it sucks. I'm very confused right now. All you have to know is the Suicide Squad is, is the good movie. You want to watch the Suicide Squad. Is that the new one? The new one, yes. The one with John Cena in it. Okay, okay, okay. Because, like... <laughs> I'm watching Big Go Super Saiyan again. It's so funny. I don't know if I'd say stuff. soft reboot. It's it's hard to say um, because they don't they don't say enough that it I could be like here's a clear answer. Like that that one definitely is just because there's just a shark man as one of the characters and just like King Shark yeah no King Shark rules in everything that he's in. I've never... King Shark in the Flash TV show is voiced by David Hayter. Wow okay yeah that's a lot to take in. And. They, they take Polka Dot Man, uh, who's one of the most, like, stupid, pathetic joke villains for Batman, and turn him into, like, a serious, depressing character in, uh, The Suicide Squad. John Cena is in it, and he's a complete douchebag. It, John Cena's thing is that, um... He is the second member of the team. Now, the first member, I guess I should say, is added to the team. That's, uh, Idris Elba. He is on the team because he was raised from a father who was in the military. He the perfect soldier, perfect shot. Now, John Cena's thing is he was raised from a father who was in the military and raised to be the perfect soldier and have the perfect shot and everything. You may be wondering, those are the same character. Yes. Yes, isn't they that, are. And the movie makes the skull, fun of that. Isn't that the Skullface dude? I forget his name. Bloodsport? No, there's a, there's Bloodsport a... is Idris Elba, and John Cena is uh, Peacemaker. Yeah, Peacemaker. Hang on, like, Peacemaker's great guy. though because he's he it's they just have a stupid rivalry the entire movie about like who's better. Like there's an entire scene of just them showing off to each other by getting a better kill. Okay, that's not what I remember. There's, there's a there's a soup there's like a anti-hero. In one of, in either DC or Marvel, where the guy's ability is he's just a copycat, you can perfectly memorize an attack. That's Taskmaster. That's it. Well, they ruined Marvel. him in the uh, in the Marvel movies. Really? He doesn't do that, and it's not even the same person. It's like some random lady. People were not happy about that. I'd imagine so. Taskmaster seems like a really cool character. Blum Lombax, what's up? Uh, this game fucking rules. And everyone in chat deserves to play it. 
This game is so strange, dude. We have all the Chaos Emeralds, all the Chaos Emeralds do a thing. One of them is just tell you where the objective is. Which is great, because I was like, that's my big complaint with the game, and then it was like, nope, it was an upgrade, and I was like, oh, okay. It's so wild that this guy recreated the levels perfectly. He did, they the all just fit. And it's just like, you know, you know exactly where the paths are, and you're just like, huh. Like, this is what, Knuckles level 2? First Knuckles level in Sonic Adventure 2. Oh, first. Yeah, you're right, you're right. Pumpkin Hill, you see what I mean? Like, it's... Big hit head, don't care. And I don't know if there's any... There has to be one more upgrade somewhere. Well, we're missing a lure upgrade, I believe, because everything else said it was at the max. Uh, so you don't have, like, a percentage meter that you're tracking? Nope. Upgrade finder would be nice. I mean, it would be kind of worthless, but... That's probably what white should be once you get froggy. No, once you get froggy, the game ends. Oh. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Don't do that. That's why I'm not going to froggy. Cool if it does, but it does not. I can't get rings, because apparently this is supposed to run on rings, but I think I glitched it. So it just it works infinitely, which it's not supposed to. Working as working as intended. Big must be powerful. Do not submit bug report, Juker. Guess I won't. Not that I was going to anyway, but... God, I thought that was just a, a tower from fucking Shadow of the Colossus. Nope. Sonic thing. As you can tell, I don't know a whole lot about Sonic. Yeah, you should play Sonic Adventure 2. I think you... Like I it. have. It is the one Sonic game I played as a kid. Sonic Adventure 1 was good. It's... Like, it's... That's why I know Pumpkin Hill so much, because I was stuck in there for hours as a child. That sounds right. That was that in Meteor Zone, from what I remember? Oh, that's a, that level sucks. Meteor Zone was bad. That's a weird gravity. That and how big it is, you don't quite know where the Emerald Shard is. Yep. So, Meteor Zone was a rude level, isn't it? Yes, but they're, they're the same thing. Oh yeah, because light is fucking Knuckles and Dark is Rouge. Yep, they're the same. Does Rouge go to the pumpkin hill? Uh, in the multiplayer. Welcome to Highwing Discover Sonic Culture. That's probably. You didn't find anything in those? No, we found the first Chaos Emerald there. We can go back, but. We can go back. Froggy's just sitting there chilling. We know where Froggy is. He's in Sonic CD. He's on the planet. Here, I'll look. Does anyone see it? Not there. There one big map. Every Sonic level has always been connected. We were just too foolish to not notice. I mean, they show you the big connection in in the, in the second Game Gear game. Apparently. I was there for Jukebox Night Juka, I saw that map. You get the upgrade in Wild Canyon? Where? And what is it? The 
like it's no coordinates. I don't think I did. A weird question to ask just because it's entirely off topic. Where is, is it? Knuckle stage does not help me. I know what Wild Canyon is. I'm talking about where where in the stage it is. Is Big and Tails gets trolled? I don't remember what that is. I've heard the it's name. The, it's the essay comic, which is just like an elaborate shitpost of like crazy IP mixing, but primarily around Sonic characters. Probably not. People didn't like Big for a while. Now it's, he's just kind of become a meme character. All right, where is this upgrade? It's apparently in Wild Canyon somewhere. Chessing is inside the cave. Inside the cave where? Big get orders. Oh, there it is. Lure power up. There's one more lure power up to get, and then we're good. Man, that was kinda hidden, wasn't it? Cause I went in here earlier, it's hard to tell there's like a water glitch. I'd like to find it, I mean we we have everything else. Ironically, like Big, nothing wrong with that. Big is, I, I dig Big's character, honestly. Yeah. Be more like Big. He's, he just wants to have fun, relax, and be with his best friend. Don't we all? Big looks at, us, Big looks at us and says, "You are the only people who pay to live on this planet." Oh, that's just the, the game not loading right. Okay. Last thing, we're so close to getting everything, and then we can beat the game. Biggest wisdom. He knows how to relax and take care of his best friend. And also pick up a handgun and shoot aliens. Yeah. Now, if you want to play the best version of Doom Fusion 3D, Wang, you should definitely play the Genesis version. Hello? What? Yeah, it's on, uh, it's, it's been on Kuso, so it has to be good. So... I, I know you're trying to take it, make this as a joke. I might take that seriously just because it'd be fun to do something. No, it's fucking terrible. Yeah. It's really bad. Don't play it. I'd like to do something just off the wall after we finish. Uh, That's the game. If Frank you want to pick it on a Thursday, you'll see it and you'll be like, oh, I regret picking this. Well, that requires me to win the lot of which I have. Not, not you, just anyone. This, this is just like, ah. oh, that sucks. This is terrible. I'm <laughs> just imagining a like, fucking like robot chicken of uh, the Nightmare Before Christmas. What's this? Oh, this, this sucks, actually. There, maybe it's in the city? I'm trying to think where it could be. Like, anyone else have any ideas where this could be? You know, why, why at the end of Sonic Adventure was it that there had to be... There, it, it had to be Sonic that got the, the emeralds. Why wasn't it big? Capitalism. Big is being put held down by the man. Oh. Yeah. Dory is an idiot, that's correct. What little I know. What? That's Sonic. This is an... Alien? Saturn? Sega Saturn? I thought this earlier, I was like, what is that? So 
Should have bought his book, now he's too powerful. Please stop buying his book. We spent so much money, it's fueled him. He's only gotten stronger. That's a bumper from Spinball? Alright, okay. You, that's, that's, that's how people get banned, so you shouldn't admit to those things. Dangerous knowledge. Forbidden knowledge. Super big is better than Omni Man? Yes. I haven't even seen Invincible or whatever it's called. Neither have I. What is that show supposed to be about? I don't know, but I think it's from the guy who made King of the Hill, because that comic appeared years ago in King of the Hill, and people are only noticing now. It appears in a random episode that Bobby Hill is just reading the Invincible comic, and it's like, oh! Look! A duck! And Mike Judge? I, it might have been him, I forget. Well, there was an upgrade here earlier, but we got that one. So that's why I'm like, where, where is this upgrade? No. Oh. Maybe it's on the planet. I don't think it is. Yeah, we got the upgrade on the planet. It was the Chaos it was, Emerald. It was the Chaos Emerald. I don't think there's ever been two places that have, well, like, two two upgrades on one planet. Well, is there an area you haven't explored before? Not really. At this point, it's easy to get around everywhere. Uh, do we find an upgrade at the racetrack? Yeah. Chaos Emerald. Okay. Uh... Got one there. Marble Zone? Got one. The froggy is either below or more nearby. Did we get one in chemical plant zone? I think we did. We did. Do you know where he is? Of course! Um, we have a white Chaos Emerald that tells you where he is. Which is the greatest thing in this game. Because that was like my big complaint was, I don't know where Big is, he could be anywhere. And then it says, hey, here's Big. We just Probably. know he's somewhere in that area, and that's honestly narrows it down a lot. It's funny how like you were given only one clue that it just told you exactly where to go. Yeah, no, I heard the music and it was like, I know, I know exactly where that is. Froggy, I will come for you after obtaining unlimited power. They're actually trying to bring King of the Hill back, chat. Um, it's gonna be a little hard because uh, a couple of those voice actors passed away. Can you even, like, do something like that? In I think uh, Luann's voice actor passed away, Lucky's voice actor passed away. Um, it was like, um, I was watching a. Uh... I was watching uh, the Beavis and Flyhead movie, and I was like, man, you really can't do this in this day and age, can you? And I'm wondering if, like, the same applies to King of the Hill. You King of the Hill? Hmm, maybe, yeah. I'm sure it's fine. Like, King of the Hill doesn't really, like, lock itself in a time zone like Beavis and Butthead did. Beavis and Butthead, they're bringing back again for a third time. I, I don't think I can do Beavis. But had a third time. They, those guys are decidedly 90s. There's not really anything you could do because MTV doesn't do music videos anymore. So it's like, yeah, you're. Missing I, I mean, honestly, that was my least favorite part of the show. I know that's a very unpopular opinion, but 
music videos. Yeah, the music videos where they they would just riff them. It was just you know something to watch. But the best like, parts were, were when they were just going around doing stuff like today we're gonna be talking about the penis and the testicles, the vagina and the clitoris. What's so funny? What's so funny, buddy? Do you think it is funny? And he's just like trying to hold back the laughter. I remember that episode very well. My my favorite edit of that is have you seen the one where it's Akuma and Ryu from I think Street Fighter Alpha Two? They're just looking at each other. No, I have not. It's this sounds edit. ridiculous. They're they're in the exact same pose if you compare them. Chat, do you think it is funny talking about sexual education? Do you think it's funny to talk about the penis? Spending a lot of time talking about masturbation! Fuck it! Your ace? I didn't know you were the gang green gang leader, Camille. That's amazing. Kind of a bad person, but I liked you in the gorillas. <laughs> Alright. For that like that two songs. A, that was such a weird pull. Canonically, Ace from the Powerpuff Girls exists as a member of the Gorillas. Yep. Cool as hell. Also I'm not making that Eric. up, it's real. Also, apparently Bruce Willis is cut out of the Little Gorillas. Yes, he's in Stylo if you watch the music video right now. Yeah. I remember that music video. He's just trying to kill those guys. He, guy, he just kind of shows up out of nowhere and is like, sup, you Bruce Willis. And you're driving on the road, and out of nowhere, someone fires a gun at you. And you look who it Bruce. is, and it's fucking Bruce Willis. You just look at that and you think, I'm going to die today. Cause that's that's how I feel like in that music video when I, when I watch it. I'm just like, that Bruce Willis, that fucking Bruce Willis fi firing at me. The music videos are so fucking wild. Remember when uh, oh god, what's Daft what's Punk? the act? No, 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 not Daft Punk. There is one. There's a music video. I forget the name of the song, but it is uh, a guy that is it is a famous actor. The guy that talks like this. That guy. Fuck, I don't know. That didn't sound know. like anything. I know, my brain's dead right now. I'm, I'm like, uh, the guy, what plays the gangster in Joker? You know that guy? No. Oh, shit. The guy that plays the lieutenant in Pulp Fiction. The lieutenant in Pulp Fiction? The guy who has the watch and talks about how he had to get out of the Christopher dead. Walken, you mean? That's it. The music video is Christopher Walken lives right free in my head, even though I'll never then know the name of the guy. He just, he's just fucking dancing the whole video, and then at one point he just flies all over the place. It's crazy. Yeah, I don't know where this last upgrade is, so I'm just looking for Froggy. Froggy, where are you? Froggy, where the fuck are you? Yeah, weapon of choice. Good song. Here, I'll show you this how it works. This is my weapon, my weapon of choice. Not exact, we just know he's around this area. He might not even be on the planet, I think he might be below it. There is a lot of water below it. Perfect place for a frog to squat. What are the ridiculous music videos? What are their ridiculous music videos in celebrity, isn't it? Uh, any of the Daft Punk ones are always really good in my opinion. Big fan of, uh... Those blue people they, that they had. Blue they, they made like a story arc out of them. Oh, I got into Daft Punk. Like they made like one more time. Is that him? He crashed into the frog and he turns into paste. <laughs> oh no, damn. I wish I could play some good music on stream, but. I wish the DCA. I wish the DCMA wasn't DM, a law. DMCA. Blame, DMCA. Uh, blame Metallica. They got DMCA though with their own performance, so. That's funny because apparently Snoop Dogg got DM DMCA'd on his own stream by playing his own music. 
Da 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 da! It's the motherfucking DMZ game. Stands for the Digital Millennium Copyright Act. And it oh, only exists to fuck you over. Oh, Not really yeah. a thing that exists to, you know, preserve an IP. Oh. It really only exists to screw you over. It exists so people in a specific subset of lot can make money. But I'm not making any money off of this. Well, too bad. That's our money, buddy. It's a fancy looking fish. What is that? I'm building this model and there's just like some part where I'm kind of like, why would you connect it like this? It'll make sense when you finish it. You can't no, skip a step no. and then you're then you're like, hmm. No, I'm not skipping a step, a step, but there's like a plate on one of the leg pieces that slots in like a fucking VHS slot and I'm like, why would you connect it like this? He's on the bottom. The floor is different. Why does he do that? Is that how frogs swim? Yeah. Huh. I, look, I've ranted about DMCA plenty of times on stream. The, the moral yeah. of it is, it sucks, it's not fair. Don't risk it. If you ever have to ask yourself, is this a DMCA? The answer is never. Never do it. Just please don't hurt a streamer. It could be the last time that you do a stream because like, you know, oh well, I thought this would be a good idea. You, you never know. There he is. Now activate your fire ability and annihilate him. So he wasn't on the planet, but good thing I heard the music, so it made it easier to find. Hard mode, there's so no audio. Fighting. Well, I couldn't Wait. find one upgrade, but we beat it. Wait! We have to fish up, Froggy? Oh, of course! That's how you do it in Sonic huh. Adventure. Uh. Yeah. They made- they all, Big only exists to sell the fishing controller. I did it! Huh. Is big poggers? Put the frogs in chat. A every frog emote you got, just put them in chat. We did it. Throw Two hours, frog. 11 minutes, and, and 7 seconds. Throw up your froggers and... Big's Big World, what a fucking great game. Quite possibly, not even a joke. The greatest Sonic fan game I have ever played. That game is Sonic. so good. What about greatest Sonic game? Which one? Would you consider that your the greatest no. Sonic game? No. What would you consider the greatest Sonic game? Probably Mania. Yeah. I didn't beat Mania, but, I, but it was still really fucking good. Uh, shame I couldn't find that last upgrade, but whatever. This ruled. Big is mighty. What are some of the options? Cycle chaos. Froggy button. The froggy button. I didn't use it much, but I mean, you know what it is. All right. Does it do anything if Froggy, froggy is nearby? I was gonna say Frogger. Oh, it's one of these games where we tab out it. Gets rid of the music. Um, well, I'm just gonna go to intermission then, if that's the case. So we can get some music. Oh man, I'm back. I've been, I've been sitting at like that low, like lean that you fall into in your computer chair when you're just like slouching and you just slowly fall down. Mm -hmm. Ugh, I, I think I've been in that for like the entire time you're doing Big's Adventure while I was just working on this kit. 
Yeah, you always gotta stretch. Even I stretch in the middle streams. I get up sometimes. Right. So, uh, schedule for this week. Sunday. We're gonna continue Sage. Uh, if you like this, definitely be there on Sunday. There's gonna be a lot of good games that we're gonna see from uh, the Sonic Amateur Games Expo. Uh, Tuesday, I don't know what it'll be. If Dalton is around, I might ask him to play some Kunio. We might do... Uh, if you don't know Kunio, it's the River City Ransom games. We might try one of the Super Nintendo River City Ransom games that released in Japan. Interesting. Uh, we, have, we have some ideas. Uh, if not, I might just play something myself. Maybe I'll find a collectible collectathon game I've always been in the mood for. Like, I've talked about doing DK64 with the Tag Anywhere mod. I could do that, too. We'll see. Um, Why would you do that to yourself? It, it lets you tag anywhere. It's, 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 no, wait. Donkey Kong Country. I thought Donkey Kong 64. No, Donkey Kong 64, yeah. Tag Anywhere. It lets you change on the fly. Oh, I see, I see. Yeah, that's, that's, that's even worth then, playing. Even then, like, mm, I don't know about 64. But then again, I'm not a huge... Like the no, fan. It's understandable. But that's probably I don't know. I will we'll see whatever happens on Tuesday. Um Thursday's jukebox. I'm starting with Kickle Cubicle. Great game. You know what color Mario's hat is, uh probably heard of the Kickle Cubicle music. Uh, and then uh Friday we'll figure something else out. We're getting close to uh October when all the stuff I have planned out is gonna be played. Oh my god, it's almost October. Yeah, and yeah, we're almost at September. Um, there might not be a stream on Tuesday, though. We'll, we'll see. It's um, Even though I just said there there probably will be, uh, I might have to do bonus charity stream modding, and if that's going to happen, no stream, but we'll see. Uh, it's a maybe right now, so... I'm not promising there's a stream. It's, it's basically just a big maybe, but... We gotta Good go raid you. someone. Good job, Juker. Never promise anything. Never be held accountable. If there's no stream Tuesday, we'll just do whatever it is on Friday. That's that's how that works. And then on Saturday, Saturday, Saturday. You guys want to just raid with five? Who to raid? Who to raid? Someone I haven't raided in a while. Uh, raid my friend uh, Willow. Willow is doing a Majora's Mask rando, apparently. That seems like a cool raid target. Double five. All right, do do five five, not fifty five five five. Yeah, she's doing some Majora's Mask rando right now, so uh, show her some love. Five five do that. Uh, show her some show her some love. Uh, I think she's doing it like a little like stream raiders if you know if you know what that is right now. But uh, Majora's Mask Mando is something that's on my list. It's been on my list for a while. I gotta get around to. I thank you all so much for being here. Uh, I hope to see you on Sunday for more Sage if you liked Big's Big Adventure. If not, have a wonderful night. Uh, no, we're done. If, if anything's done at 2 a.m., I'm, I'm done. I'm out of here. Thank you all so much for being here. Uh, peace out. What are your...